Hi, welcome to our IDQ Pro tutorial series. My name is Helena, and today I'll be talking about how to use the Structure Similarity Index in IDQ Pro. This feature calculates the SSIM score for 3D datasets after DataCube processing using the original DataCube as the reference image. This metric quantifies image changes caused by processing, such as data filtering. A value closer to 1 indicates higher similarity to the original image. To start, you'll want to open a file. And I want to demonstrate there has been no changes done to this current file. It's the original. And if we do the structure similarity index, the output value is 1, meaning that it is exactly the same as the original image. If we go to filtering and enhancement and select 3D Gaussian filter, the filter is now complete, and go back to Structure Similarity Index, it will now calculate the difference. This pop-up window will produce the Calculated Structural Similarity Index. A value closer to 1 indicates higher similarity, and a value closer to 0 indicates low similarity. It's important to note that the Structural Similarity Index is only possible between two datasets of the same dimensions which means that if you've done any cropping, this feature will not work properly. For more information, visit idcubes.com documentation.